राम राम दोस्तों हम न्यूजीलैंड के नॉर्थलैंड में हैं और काल मुझे यहाँ के सरप्राइज लोकेशन पे लेके जा रहे हैं तो मुझे नहीं पता हम कहाँ जा रहे हैं तो देखे पहली लोकेशन क्या है हाँ दिस इज द फर्स्ट लोकेशन राइट है ये जुगनू का भाई का घर है समझ गया बेब जुगनू के भाई का घर हाँ नहीं समझी लुक एट दिस लुक एट दिस We're going to take you guys to some incredible places whoa, whoa, around Northland here in New Zealand. It's Look at this babe. Look at this. Slippery and muddy. Just get the vibe first. And look up here. If you don't know much about Northland, it's known for its incredible beauty like all the New Zealanders. It's known for its beaches, it's known for its islands for kayaking, for fishing. It's known for illegal marijuana cultivation. <laughs> did you know that? No, I did not. Be careful so here. This is the Manali of New Zealand. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> But just look where we're going. Whoa! This is so slippery, babe. Oh, it Be was careful, really babe. slippery. Stay near me, no? Yeah. <laughs> Last place I want to fall. Uh, oh, oh. Okay, wait, round two. I slipped into one of these holes because we couldn't see. <laughs> so we're going to take off our shoes and go in here. And uh, <laughs> we'll show you why, why I brought her here. I think we can walk through the water like they have. Did you find the glowworms? Yeah. yeah. Cool. So we're in this cave and we could not see a thing. There's nothing that way. There's a few people that way who are leaving. And if you look on the cave roof, yeah, it's beautiful. Um, it's like that. Taro, vale, asman ke niche khade hain. Lekin yaha ka trek thoda mushkil hai, bahut slippery bhi hai. To kuch Crocs type ka pehen ke aana. Yeah, we've we've taken off our shoes and we're just walking through the water. It's like an underground kind of stream, and it gets pretty difficult. So we're going to stop here, but. Like, see, it's starting to come. I'm starting to bend down now, and you've got to climb like underneath through these, through this rock system. So, um, yeah, be prepared for this. And maybe bring someone who knows what they're doing. We're not going to go any further than this stuff. But there's a lot of caving like this in New Zealand that you can do, and you will find these incredible things like glowworms, like like a jugnu. So I had no idea how difficult that would be, how muddy <laughs> that would be. <laughs> and look at her pants, wrecked. <laughs> how romantic. Was it? Oh know. shit, I'm slipping again. <laughs> oh god. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that oh. was the Waipu Caves or Jugnu Kabai Kagat. So this vlog started with a bang. <laughs> Where will I take her next? We just stopped for a baby hedgehog. See that? It's a little baby hedgehog crossing the road. All right, you got to cross. See you later, brother. See, these animals are actually nocturnal. He's meant to be sleeping right now. I don't know if they can see during the day or what. Maybe they can, but yeah, they only come out at night usually. Bye bye. Where are we, babe? हम आज एक ब्लूबेरी फार्म पे हैं क्योंकि हम नॉर्थ में जा रहे हैं न्यूजीलैंड के एकदम नॉर्थ पे जहाँ पर दोनों ओशंस मिलते हैं और रास्ते में ब्लूबेरी फार्म पे रुके हैं जहाँ पर खेती होती है बेरीज की तो यहाँ पर आकर आप अपने बेरीज तोड़ भी सकते हो और उन्हें ले जा सकते हो और इसके अलावा ये लोग कुछ बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग करते हैं ये फ्रेश ब्लूबेरीज और स्ट्रॉबेरीज से बनी आइसक्रीम्स और स्मूदीज बनाते हैं और हम वही ट्राई करने वाले हैं नेक्स्ट Manisha actually found this place. It wasn't me. <laughs> I yeah, always babe. keep an eye for these places. Babe, from the window here. <laughs> Oops. Oh, there it is. Sure. <laughs> wow. China. Mm. You should try this. Taze? Ah, it's some taze. Oh my God. Yeah. Out of this world, amazing! Mm. Definitely the best I've had. Me too. What about the ones on the ground? They're oh well, I mean they're on the ground. I mean yeah. some some we don't pick them up. That's for sure. Yeah, they're But done. You right. see this? Uh, you get that with this variety of blueberries, you get that those big bunches. 
yeah. But you still have to, you don't, you don't pick them like this, you still have to roll each individual berry. Oh. Yeah. That's why picking blueberries is quite labour intensive. You're always thinking, oh, well, I'll take this one, this one, this one, this one, you know, you're sort of yeah. deciding which, you, which to pick. And I'm always having to teach people that with pick your own. So now we have Justin who is the owner of this farm and he has given us a very good tour and shown how the blueberries are growing. People are very friendly here. Ah, it was really nice, I didn't have to do that. that yeah. And to be honest, that, that won't happen a lot. So yeah, this is a really nice place. Put the link in the description. Yeah. It's a good thing. Today, we got a good time. Today, we got a good time. Today, there's no rain. There's no rain. And on the rest of the trip, usually there was a lot of rain and rain. And the weather was not so good for the drive, but today is perfectly perfect. Yeah. New Zealand can be really, really hit and miss for weather. Like, we got here two months ago. And we basically had bad weather the entire time. And this is the first day where we've got like this incredible day with, you know, no clouds, blue skies, it's hot. So yeah, that's the risk when you travel to New Zealand. Yeah, the weather. <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to take a look at some fun. I don't know what it is. Surprise. We're going to do something very, very fun next. And you're going to love it. Babe, where are we and what are we doing? I think you have your own mini Rajasthan in New Zealand. This reminds me of Dubai <laughs> a lot as well. Huh. Reminds me of Jaisalmer. We're walking up giant, giant sand dunes here in New Zealand next to Cape Rianga. And we got these boards because... We're sandboarding. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> we are going to surf down these dunes. बहुत मेहनत करके पंद्रह मिनट में चढ़ते हैं, लेकिन जब बहुत जल्दी नीचे आ जाते हैं। हाँ। तो फन है, लेकिन बहुत थका देता है। हाँ, मुश्किल है। Yeah, tons of fun, but a lot of work for that fun. But I'm glad we tried it. हाँ हाँ, this is definitely fun. And there's very few places to do this in New Zealand. Uh -uh. This is one of the spots. Dave, Dave Clay, I'm here. Itni khubsurat hai na? Bahut khubsurat hai. Itni? Kitna khubsurat? Itna khubsurat hai. That beach looks absolutely perfect, yeah, Hannah. Yeah, yeah, untouched. And the islands out there. Mm. Now let me show you. You can see just over here where the two oceans are meeting. Let's go. Yep. If we had to live in New Zealand, this is where you want to live? I want to live anywhere <laughs> in Northland. Anywhere in Northland because, as you can see, and you can hear these cicadas, that means it's stinking hot. I need the warmth, man. I can't live anywhere cold, and Northland's the warmest me part too. of New Zealand. <laughs> me too. It's too cold for me down south. Yeah. Manisha's walking around, and people are saying to her, that'll keep the sun off. Yeah, it's too hot. But it's because of her skin. She doesn't have any pigmentation in her skin. It's all naturally left her body since her teenage years. So that's why you'll see her always like caked in sunscreen. sunscreen. <laughs> like that white stuff, just, or else, because she gets burnt like that. I don't get burnt, like put our skin together. I'm brown, way browner than you. <laughs> so that's why she's got to cover herself and wear a lot of sunscreen because she gets burnt like that. And New Zealand, it doesn't matter what your skin color is, you can still get burned here because there's, there's less ozone layer in the sky, right? That's one tip. It doesn't matter what skin color you are, you'll get burned here. Wear sunscreen. Yeah. We are getting from the Tasman Sea and Pacific Ocean. And we can actually see the waves in the actual way. There are very few places where you can see something like this. Right? And it represents new life, the creation of new life. That's what the Maoris 
कि इंडिजिनस पीपल ऑफ न्यूजीलैंड से हां मौरी कल्चर के हिसाब से मेल सी और फीमेल सी मिलते हैं आपस में और क्रिएशन ऑफ लाइफ को रिप्रेजेंट करता है ये जगह और यहां एक लाइट हाउस भी है जहां पर हम अब जाएंगे Oh man, this place is beautiful. If you you got to come here. You got to come here. This is not exactly like you know. Ha, aisa roz roz to nahi dikhega yaar. Ye bahut kam aise chance milenge jahan par aisa kuch dikhega. Yeah, this ain't right in the luge or doing something real exciting, but it's just an incredible little walk around the beautiful part of the world. That way we've got London, Sydney, Tokyo. And this way Los Angeles back that way south pole I just find this this area amazing Hana <laughs> Isn't it just stunning just the oh my god the water looks beautiful This is New Zealand at its best honestly mm, Yeah This is what I wanted you to see when you came here wanted you to see the the epic beauty of New Zealand and we found it here that's for show <laughs> It's a great experience और अगर न्यूजीलैंड का नॉर्थ का मैप देखा होगा तो एक ऐसे शेप जाती है और वो पता लग रहा है कि एग्जैक्टली exactly अच्छा यहाँ पर हैं हम और उस तरफ है हमारा घर हाँ हमारा घर <laughs> इस तरफ है लेट्स गो होम बेब चलो